Okay, here are the results. So the black dots, these are the true values, our simulated data set, and the three curves show uh, our estimated regressions, the linear, the quadratic, and the octic specification. So the linear one is just this red line, the quadratic is the green line, and the blue, very wiggly function is the octic um, uh, functional form. And what we see basically, uh, the optic form matches this training data set we use to estimate the form the best. So if you would compute uh, the sum of the squared residuals, so the uh, vertical difference between the black points and the curves, you will see that's uh, the smallest for the optic uh, function. However, we see also that this is quite wiggly. Yeah? So this is a typically sign of overfitting. So it seems to uh, fit structure that's not necessarily there so it seems to the the form of the blue curve seems to depend a lot on also on random noise so but overall in machine le learning one cares very little about how well a model can predict the bias on the training data set that we use to estimate the model to evaluate the out of sample prediction accuracy one checks how well models predict y on a new data set and here we call it a test data set that has not been used to estimate the model. And in the following plot, we will show the predicted values by head for our three models, the linear, the quadratic, and the optic specification on a new test data set uh, with 100 new observations that have not been used to estimate the model.